Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, today I have a little unboxing and you may know the straps go. They sell lots of all kinds of watch straps. All kinds of watch straps. And they they, they sent me some samples uh, for me to check out. And um, I got these three straps and I just want to open them, uh, show you and maybe try them on on my favorite watches so the first one I got uh, is here this is a some sort of a NATO strap and uh, just want to open it it's a uh, vintage uh, like a distressed NATO strap uh, and it's a uh, it appears to be a leather one but I'm not completely sure it's a uh, so real weather uh, this one here but it does look cool uh, it looks really cool and one thing I don't like I like about this is that it has this padding which will keep it waterproof and I uh, though that's the only issue I have with leather straps as the waterproofness and the sweat especially in the summer but I like the this is like a Zulu with the heavy duty rings and uh, I can't wait to try this on. I will probably put this on this watch because this is my favorite watch. But uh, <coughs> another one I have is this is this this should go on my Breitling or Orient. And this is a I believe this is the Sari, the Sari, uh, and. This one feels much nicer than the nail and this one could be really nice with my Orient. This is a navy blue but it's kind of not a glossy finish, it's kind of distressed and uh, it's almost gray uh, but I really like it uh, whether it's a gray or navy blue and I think it, sh it should work great with some of my watches especially if you have Orient or I think it will be great with Breitling and one of the the straps I was mostly excited about to see <coughs> I'm sorry about the coughing uh, was this one this one is a uh, this one, let's see, this one has a name, it says just genuine leather. Uh, this one is also the Sari as well. And I love this padding uh, below uh, to protect it from sweat. But you gotta love this color, man. Uh, check out this color. And this is a like vintage distressed look color. And I think it looks really, really nice. And uh, all these straps uh, come with the uh, spring bars in them. So that's really neat as well. So I have these straps here. Uh, I have some needles. And now I have two of my favorite watches. And I will uh, try them on with these straps. Okay, I removed the bracelet from Orient and uh, right before removing this bracelet I just want to show like a before uh, and after because it really, uh, if you change a strap on your watch, it really does transform your watch like completely transform and the look is the very very different. Okay, now I have them both off and now I'm in a big dilemma which one to put where first. So I guess I want to try this one because I'm really excited about this one here. And uh, let's just see this. Oh, I love this look. But let's just see here on the bright wing as well. I think it works on Orient much nicer, but it's not bad on this one as well. So. Firstly, I will put this one here, and uh, I will put this, the sari one, here. So it's a really, you can already tell it's a different, but I have a needle one. 
I'm really curious to check that one out because this one will be very cool for the summer and uh, oh this Orient loves leather straps I'm telling you that's an excellent watch and does really love leather straps so let's move on and I will cut it here and install it so it won't be too long with it so here's the first pair um, <clears throat> I decided to put this beige Passari on a Brightwing and an Orient on a distressed uh, blue, navy blue on an Orient. I think Orient just just looks gorgeous. I don't know what do you think, uh, but I really uh as the moment I put this on, I don't wanna I don't wanna remove it, I don't wanna change it and uh but I gotta try, I gotta put this one on this one and uh, the vice versa. So yeah, but here's a pair. These are the straps code Dasari. Here you can find them on strapsco.com and uh, I think it looks awesome. I cannot just stop looking at this Orient. But let's have a take a look, brief look at the Brightwing and uh, take a look at this, the stress beige color uh, I have and I love this look as well so let me just quickly put it on the wrist I can tell you that this one is uh, much softer and easy to work with than this one because I think this one is made for Brightwing as well it was made in mind to be with the Brightwing so here's a quick wrist shot and I think it looks gorgeous I'm really gonna enjoy wearing this one and it's a great occasion sometimes you want to wear brown shoes sometimes you want to dare but I love this color and I think it works perfectly with this watch uh, this watch is, has a black dial but at a certain angles outside due to its air coating it has a navy blue dial so uh, I really love playing with these straps and let me just give you a wrist shot with the Orient and one thing these are padded so it will protect the bracelet from the sweat uh, this one here is, has a little insert in the inlays here padding and down there is much softer so but let's see how it looks on the wrist it's definitely harder to put it on the wrist due to its padding and I just think it needs to break in a little bit because after the breaking in period uh, this will look much better uh, so yeah I like it I like it what do you I don't know what do you guys think it looks a bit deep and has a little curving up here to hug the locks much better but this Orient loves bracelet so I think whatever you put on this oriented will go great but uh, I always wanted to check out the navy blue uh, and the orient and I think this is a great contrast as well because uh, the band has no gloss to it and uh, the watch is so shiny uh, that it's a really nice contrast and I do like contrast so uh, now I have this one to check it out I don't think it will work on a Brightwing but uh, we'll leave it that for later I just wanna switch these two to the here so I will return to you now look we'll at these two bad boys I think this is much better combo and uh, this Brightwing is work as made for uh, bluer one stitching and this one just looks awesome I also I'm so excited I almost don't want to put it on an Aiden right now because this is I think this is an awesome combo uh, just to check it out and uh, this this band here works great uh, it's great quality has a nice padding here right up in here it needs a little breaking in but that just tells me it's a good it's thick and sturdy and it's, it's a Dasari brand uh, and also has this waterproof lining down there so I'm digging this hook really nice I think it dresses down Brightwing a lot and if you want to go sometimes under the radar uh, but 
it really is hard to go under the radar so good thing is about this stuff this one's much softer I like this one the most um, good thing about this uh, too is that you really uh, don't have to be stuck with any of these because they are interchangeable so whenever I feel like it I can put this one here or one this one here so depends on the mood guys so uh, yeah and just let me just put this on a hand on the wrist this one is much much softer and easy to work with it has that vintage look uh, and uh, I think think it's it's not bad it's not half as bad yeah here I found a perfect angle and perfect shot for this one oh I think this is a perfect for Breitling and even though I do like the croco alligator grains and styles uh, this one with the distressed sweet look uh, it's a perfect contrast for shiny polished Breitling and um, uh, it's a really thick and it doesn't look out of place on a, such a watch so there's only one thing left uh, and that's for me to slide in this NATO strap and uh, some of you may not know but this is how you install the NATO strap you firstly put the spring bars then you loop it and uh, keep calling this an Edo but I, I think it's a Zillow because of the rings but I'm not really sure so someone you guys uh, know better you can correct me it says here Strapsco uh, 22 and I think it looks, it looks, it looks really great I was thinking that the uh, beige color would look nicer but uh, this needle works really nice so I'm gonna put it on the wrist just to see so this is the first time uh, and it slides very easy under the under the cups so you just loop it across and some of you guys don't know uh, some of you think it's silly but if you have access weight of this needle what you can do is you can just do this and now it looks nicer I really like this access because I wanna I can put it like this so what do you think guys it has this little discoloration here um, let me just move the angle so here is a little wrist shot I gotta say uh, um, this one is my least favorite and the quality is not up to the standard of these other two bands but nevertheless uh, I think it looks very neat on my watch all right that's it uh, got nothing else to say pretty much except to wrap this up give you my conclusions and uh, I gotta tell you the I really want to thank you thank Trapsco for sending these specimens uh, they, they have a great customer service so uh, and they are very responsive I actually bought from them before and now I got these three I got, if I had to pick uh, my my least favorite out of these bunch is the NATO one and uh, my most favorite my favorite one is the this one just because of the color and it's softest it's very soft this one needs a little breaking in but I think it suits my bright wing very nice and I will put uh, only thing I will have to do is put a um, original bright wing buckle here and I will think I will keep it like this uh, so thank you for watching uh, and uh, see you guys on the next video please uh, do me a favor and uh, check out was it straps co and uh, they have a bunch of straps from stainless steel to natos to the leather ones there's a big variety and uh, 
I think they are based in United States, so I got my package from United States, so I think they are definitely based in United States, so uh, thank you for watching, nothing uh, else to say, uh, I will put a link in the description box uh, where you can find all this stuff, uh, the straps go, and do me a favor and go over there and click uh, search and find one of the straps you like the most and put a link in the description box so maybe someone sees it and decides to send you one so thank you for watching and please give it a thumbs up like share and subscribe i'm edc gunner